The next book is uh, another thriller fiction book. And uh, I reviewed previously the same author's book, Midnight Plus One. And I mentioned then that he'd written uh, several other books, including a couple of series featuring the same characters. And this is the first of a series he did uh, later on uh, featuring Major Maxim. And it's this book, The Secret Servant. And the premise is that Major Maxim is an SAS officer who is seconded to Downing Street in the wake of a scandal to be a sort of um, troubleshooter for the Prime Minister. And he's working directly to a chap called George, who, is, who runs the private office. And uh, the first plot um, uh, involves um, really vetting a, a professor who the uh, government wants to appoint as a special advisor. And this guy is under threat for some reason. And um, the plot goes back to uh, Second World War. Very, very well-written character, as always in the Gavin Lau books. Uh, very, very good on technical stuff. Uh, as I mentioned before, Gavin Lau was a, a pistol shooter. And um, the characters are very, very uh, well-drawn. The political characters and people that uh, Major Maxim liaises with from um, MI5, the security service, and later on uh, the SIS, the MI6, the Secret Intelligence Service, and so on. Um, there's a certain amount of um, direct action in it, um, which, um, which, which is uh, similarly very, very well done. In the same series, though, they were they followed up with the conduct of Major Maxim, the Crocus List, and Uncle Target, and out of them, the Crocus List was particularly good. It, it uh, was around about it, it was um, about a theme of um, American stay behind parties in Europe, which was later revealed as being in existence with the the Gladio networks and. Um, uh, it, it was uh, one based in the UK and again it goes back in history and uh, that's a particular favourite of mine. If you can get hold of them, Secret Servant, Servant and its successors um, are really, really great reads. Uh, Secret Servant was made into a TV drama starring Charles Dance as Major Maxim. I didn't actually get to see it because I was overseas when it was shown and I don't think they ever uh, showed it again. They, BBC probably used the tapes to tape record some chat shows or something. Um, but uh, I, from what I understand, it was fairly well done. Um, and that's the only one that they did of it. So uh, the works of Gavin Lyle, they're, they're still in print and they're still available on Kindle. And I, I strongly recommend them.